Hello, hello. Today I'm going to show you how to perform um, in, in case of troubleshooting of your iPad Pro. In this case, it's the iPad Pro from 2024. Um, if you have a lot of failures, software based failures in the system and you cannot enter into the system, you have freeze frame, um, software that does not work or an, 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 an reboot does not work or the um, in a restore settings does not work on your iPad, then a good solution for this is to enter into the DFU mode and then you can um, make a clear factor reset of it. Okay, this is an emergency um, reset. That means this is the uh, the, um, the the hard the the hard reset on the bottom side of this iPad. Okay. What we need is iTunes running in the background and we will need a um, wired connection with a computer system or a Mac. Okay, that means this is the first step. We connect each other. And then we have to perform um, um, a, a little bit. That means we have to perform here. We have volume up, volume down and the power button on the device. And there we, these three buttons we will need um to enter into the dfu mode and we 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 can perform with the dfu mode the direct firmware upgrade mode we can perform an, an, an hard reset or a uh, reset of the system or we can root our ipad with that how we do that the first thing is we have to shut down the system this is the best thing because it's easier this way because we have, I will repeat over there, have a look. This is the volume up, this is the volume down, and this is the power button, okay? And we have to perform vol uh, these buttons in a rhythm. And after this, we tell this iPad to go into the DFU mode, okay? So the first thing is volume up, volume down, power button, then five seconds, we are, um, also again, again, volume up, volume down, power button, then power button and volume down button for five seconds. After five seconds, we release the power button and keep pushing the volume down button. Okay, Ooh, but we can handle this. But the prop is, if you have a problem on the screen, you cannot see that your um, iPad is, is, is shut off or is still running, then your timing is the, is the key for that. I will show you. Volume up, volume down, power button. You see now it is going to, it's going to, to, um, to the shut off version of it. Okay. That means if your screen is broken or something, you cannot see this. And this is a tricky thing. So. The first step is we have to switch off the device. This is possible, of course, slide to power off, yes, but you can also do the same if your timing is the right thing, volume up, volume down, power button, until it shuts down. And if it shuts down, in this moment, that means the reboot is going on. So if the reboot is going on, we push volume up, volume down, then release the bows, and then push power button and uh, volume down button for five seconds. After five seconds, we release the power button and keep pushing the volume down button. And then it will be into the view mode entering. Okay, let's perform this. Okay, volume up, volume down, power button. One, two, three, four, five. Release the power button. One, two, three, four, five. And now we have uh, it, it should be entered into the DFU mode. And we performed this. Oh, yeah. Okay, let's go to the computer. Here we are. Let's have a look at the computer. You see, nothing works anymore. Your iPad is broken. Oh, no. No, no. Everything is fine. Yes, we can see here now. iTunes has detected an iPad in DFU mode. We have to restore this iPad before it can be used with iTunes. Okay. And now the next step will be restore the iPad. Of course. Are you sure you want to restore the iPad 
to its factory settings. All our meteors and other dodges will be erased. And the newest version of the iPad software will be installed. That's cool. And this is the big fact behind that. After this, most of the troubles are, are gone after this. So restore and update. Now we have to agree, agree, and it goes on. Hmm. But we can't see anything. Nothing we can see. Okay. Hmm. 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 But we have to wait. Because now, in the background, iTunes is downloading the newest version of it, and then it will be transferred, this version, into this system here. Okay? So, if you have problems with iTunes or something else happens, then your iPad is broken anymore. It does not respond anymore. Hmm. Or it does not... Uh, is the right resolution for you. Hmm. Then we have to come back out of the DFU mode. In this case, we perform a hard reset or a soft reset or rebooting process. That means we push volume up, volume down, power button until we see the Apple branding. And that um, grabs back our iPad Pro into the standard boot uh, process again, okay? The other thing is, after 20 minutes of nothing, the iPad Pro will reboot automatically, okay? So, everything is fine. But with the DFU mode, you're able, if you are in the DFU mode, um, you can make a root profit uh, with that Apple iPad Pro, for example. Or you can restore it, as I showed you before, with iTunes. This will cost you 20 minutes or 30 or 40 minutes. And after this process, you have a new iPad with a new software version. And most of the time, this is a solution for your problems. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe me and give me a positive feedback. And I hope to see you again on my channel. See you soon.